Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to share with you guys some of the goodies that I've picked up from Target and Walmart. So if you guys are interested in watching, let's just get right into the video. <laughs> So like I said, I'm here today and I wanted to share with you guys the Halloween decor that I purchased at Target and Walmart. I also ordered some Halloween decor online from Walmart that I um, didn't see in my store. Um, so I'm going to start with Target just because there's a little bit less of it and it's like closest to me. So the first thing that I picked up at Target are these like mini lights. They're just like orange, green, and purple. And I thought these would be great for my Halloween tree. Um, and there's a hundred lights so I'm hoping that one package is enough. Um, there's no price on these but I think they're around like five or like six dollars or something like that um so I just got one package of that and then the uh, next item that I had to get I'm usually not into these like um globe things um but I had to get this one because it has the spooky house I don't know if you can see it because there's like a glare um, but it has like a spooky house in it and just lights up and plays music, I believe. Um, and then there's just like a bunch of skeletons that like go around it. And I had to get this one. Like I said, I'm usually not into these globes, but I just really liked the house inside of this one, like the design this year. Um, and this was $35.00. And I am so excited to have this because it will go with the next couple of items that I purchase. And I think it will go great with my decor. So speaking of the other one, I did have to get the one that had the spooky tree in it. And it just looks like it's a graveyard with a tree in the middle um, with like an owl on it. It's hard to see because there's such a glare from the plastic. But this one was $15 and it does the same thing. It like lights up and whatnot um so i had to pick this one up and then the next item that i had to purchase was the house this house matches the other one um and it um lights up and it plays like spooky sounds um this one there's no price on this one it um, but I did have to pick this one up. I think, like, this is maybe, like, 15 or, like, 20 or something like that. Um, yeah, I don't know why, but some of the stuff doesn't have prices. So, anyways, this is what the house looks like, and there's, like, a spooky moon, um, with some bats, and I'm so obsessed with this. I had to get it when I saw it online. I just wanted to go to the store to, like, look at it before I decided to pull the trigger on the purchase. Um, but I'm so happy that I was able to find this guy. And then the rest of the stuff I purchased was from Walmart. Um, so the first thing, this is what I got in store. I'll show you guys the in store purchases and then I'll move to the online purchases. So this one was $7.98. It's just an LED spider web. They have a couple of options, um, with these spider webs, but I got the ones with the orange, purple, and green lights. They have like just an orange one, just a green one, and just a purple one, I do believe, but I liked how this one had all three colors because it like goes with those lights that I got from Target. So I had to pick this one up and it looks like it has an orange spider like in the middle and I'm super excited about this. Um, and then the next item that I got in the store are these string lights. They're $5.98 with 10 lights mini lights clear and then they're like pumpkin shaped and I thought these looked like the blow molds a little bit so I'm super set obsessed with these lights um, I'm so happy that I was able to get them and they're just so cute they could go on a tree or they could just like go like on my headboard or something like that so I had to pick these up when I saw them and then the next thing that I got from the Walmart at the store was $12.98. And it's just this ghost wall decor USB LED lights with cool white. I wish this was like warm white. That's like my only complaint about this. But I saw this online I think in previous years and I wasn't able to get my hands on it because it's just been like sold out but I was able to find mine in the store which was super exciting I think I went to the store like the day after like they stocked 
Um, so I was like lucky enough to find some of this stuff, but my Target or my Walmart usually doesn't get like all of the lines because it's not like a super like Walmart or anything. So it just has like some of the stuff. Um, so this is the ghost and I'm so excited to hang this up and see what it looks like. Like I said, it's cool white. I wish it was warm white because most of like my Halloween decorations have the warm, um, white, but I think that this will be like fine if it's like hanging on a window or something like that. Um, so I'm super excited about that one. And then the last item that I picked up in store, um was this jack-o-lantern it was 1897 it's a 16 inch and it just like plugs and I like the plug-in ones I don't like the battery operated ones as much just because I feel like it kills the battery so fast and it, the light isn't as bright um so the face just looks like this like I said it's a bigger one um and then I did order a couple of more jack-o-lanterns online because my store only I think had this option um, but online I was able to find a couple of more options so I had to get this I love the color orange of the Walmart jack-o-lantern and so I had to pick it up when I saw it so that is just what the face looks like it's kind of happy but like a little scary happy it's not like a super happy pumpkin like I usually purchase but I thought that this would go well with the Home Depot ones I bought in previous years so that is that one and then I got the next couple of things um online so I had to get the three stacked this was $16.97 this is 16 inch and these all plug in so this is what the um three stacked jack-o-lantern looks like and I'm so happy I was able to purchase these online as well I'm shocked that a lot of this stuff wasn't already sold out um, but I'm happy to have that one. I'm thinking I'm going to put them like under my Halloween tree or something like that. Um, and then the next one, I really like the shape. Um, it was $14.98, 11 inches according to the tag. And this one, like I said, they plug in and it just looks like this. I really like the shape of this one. That's why I pulled the trigger on this one as well. Just figured I'd get the set while I was like placing an order. So this is the next pumpkin um face and then I do have another one like all the way back here <laughs> so the next pumpkin I picked up was $9.98 um according to the tag nine inches plugs in as well and it just looks like this it's more of a happy face I do have a happy face one from a previous year at Walmart but it is a different Base, so I figured I would pick this one up while it was like online in my cart so that in this one seems a little bit smaller than the other one but I just like the different sizes and variations so I picked this one up and for that price you can't really beat it um the next thing I picked up was this guy right here it's $15.98 it says it's a 35 inch flocked skeleton um, so it's like one of the ones that has like the, um, whatever that material is, like the velvet almost material, and it's just this bright orange, and I thought this would be cute to hang on my door. My sister got one, I think a black one, that was similar from Joann's, and she hung it on her door, and I liked how that looked. So when I saw that Walmart had a similar one in orange, I thought I would get it. Um, I think this is like a good size for a door as well so I'm super excited I was able to get like a flocked one because I feel like that's kind of trendy and I think Joann's like I went online the other day or whatever and they didn't have them anymore and I think Joann's is more than $15.98 um, regular price anyway so I figured I'd get the one from Walmart and it seems like it's a pretty good quality um, so I'm happy to have this one and like hang it on my door and stuff. Um, yeah, so I really like that guy. And then the jaw moves just a little bit, uh, if you guys are interested. And then the, um, hands seem like they move a little bit. 
Um, and then the last item I had to order online, it was kind of an impulse. These other ones I've been looking at for kind of a while, but this one was $11.87. It's the metal haunted house that they came out with. Um, so it just has a tree with a bat on it. And it's just this spooky house that you can put like a tea light in. And I thought this would go great with all the ones that I've picked up at Home Goods in the years. I think it matches it really well. And for the price, I could not beat it. So that was the last item that I picked up at Walmart like I said I'm obsessed with the black houses and I think it goes great with all the bright orange stuff that I just showed you guys um so that is everything I have to share with you guys in today's video if you guys liked it please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one and with all that said thank you guys so much for watching today's video Bye, everybody.